Computer. We have our first contestant. This show is How Dumb Are You? Hey, hey, okay. And his name is. You the winner, my dude. What's your name? Uh, Austin. Austin. He's gonna be our first person. We're gonna test him later on. We're gonna ask you 15 questions. You get each question right. He gets a do He gets two dollars. Do the math. If he can get all those questions right, he end up about, I think about 30. Yeah, 30 dollars. This is episode one. How dumb can you be? All right. I'm gonna ask you the first question. He wins two dollars for each question. Two dollars for each question. All right. Let's go. Between one and 46, what number president was Obama? And you have 10 seconds to answer each question. Uh, uh, the 45th? And he's wrong one time. He doesn't get the $2. President Obama was... 44, <laughs> you was close, my guy. All right, you got another chance to win another $2. Let's go. In what year did they abolish slavery? Bro, I, it's 19. That's a seventh grade question. 2019. It was at this moment that I knew he was not getting nothing right at all. Uh, 85, no, 1965. <laughs> <laughs> wrong! He's wrong again! <laughs> so, I'm going to give you another chance. You still have about a couple more questions left, my guy. And we're still in the history part. All right? History, bro. Okay, I got another one. <laughs> what black man had a dream of black and whites being together and living together? That's Martin Luther King. Dini, 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 dini. He's won two dollars. Let's get it. Who was the first signature on the Declaration of Independence? Uh, Abraham Lincoln. And you're wrong again. You can't do math questions. Oh, I'm gonna keep going. Life, everything. What is the full name of the woman that played the black psychic that can tell the future on Disney Channel? He act like I know that. At this moment, that's when I realized how old I really am. How old I really am. What? Shouldn't he know that? It's on Disney Channel now, yeah, too. Yeah, you should know that. Uh, Zendaya? What? <laughs> <laughs> it is Raven Simone! That's Raven? All right. That show. All right. You got you another chance. Raven? <laughs> you got it. You got it. You got another chance. How many pennies make up a hundred dollars? A thousand? No, no, ten thousand. You're right. He gets another two dollars. How many times a day should you brush your teeth? Twice. It looks like you're correct. We're gonna give you two dollars on that one. One wave. Let's go over here to the stash and give this guy two more dollars. Alright. Are you how many teeth does the regular human have? Come on, you got it, guy. Ten seconds. Twenty. And how dumb. Can you be? <laughs> the regular human has 32. All right? But you still got more chances. Here we go. What position does LeBron James play? Small forward. You're right. You're right. Teams are in the NBA. Mm, I feel like they're in the 50s. And... <laughs> You're wrong once again. Here goes a couple more rounds. These are life situations. Do you think you can handle life situations pretty good? Mm -hmm. We're gonna see. 
on what date of the month? And I'm asking you this question, because you said seven grade questions, but I'm asking you this question because sometimes you think you are grown. Mm -hmm. So what date of the month do you have to pay the rent? Um, on the 30th. Uh, yeah, at the end you can't of the change month. your answer! At the end of the month. It is the first through the third, my guy. First? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay. How dumb can you be? <laughs> All right, you still got some more chances. What is the name of the tools you would use to change your mom's tire? Uh, Come on, you got thing. it. You know that thing? <laughs> I know. I know. From the store, you know you can. You're a 10 seconds to stop. <laughs> it is a car jank. A car jank. Long wrench. And that is all you needed, my guy. A car All wrench. right. Mm -hmm. So now you know when your mom's tire gets flat, you can help her out. All right. You got one more question. What? If you came, if you came across a bear in the woods, what should be the best way to get away? By running. Eh. What? Eh. <laughs> the best way to get away from a bear is by backing up slowly and calmly. If you run, that is the worst way. Or now you, you know. You have just been saved by Stroud, my guy. How dumb can you be? <laughs> but you know what? You got your money. And I guess from here, we can say you were brave for playing the game. Oh, you got we will be back with more episodes, more dummies <laughs> to be part of this show. <laughs> I love it. You love it. Let's love it together. <laughs> I'm out.